hello and <laughs> welcome back to so april so today i have a fabric haul and some vinyl to show i'll go ahead and show the fabric first it's not that many things uh knit pop had another amazing sale i think this was like right after christmas so i told y'all i was gonna try really hard not to but when I saw this material, I was like, oh my gosh. It reminded me of, um, there's a movie called The Wedding Date with Beb Deborah Messing. And she wears this outfit with these, like, Arg Argyle socks. Jeez, I can't English. Anyways, and I saw this material and I was like, oh my gosh, that would be so cute. I could make a, a vest type, um pattern with it and I know Petite Citry has one I can't remember the name of it but it's like preppy something and I'll go ahead and show it oh, I just think this is so cute and I guess I should show it the right way and um, I'm going to make some matching socks to go with it and after I looked up on the, the movie she's not wearing this at all but it reminded me of it and I thought it was so cute so I love Argyle type stuff I thought that was just so adorable so then they had it in orange so I got a little little piece for just one that other one um my youngest daughter said that she wanted a set too so I'm gonna make her some so there's that and then like I love this shirt with the waffle knit they had one oh, I love this color it's like a aqua turquoise and uh, you all know this is like my favorite color so I will be making a shirt with this and I just love that so much and then got two more um, a while back uh, on Olga's Closet, I had got some leopard prints, and I don't think I had enough for a shirt. I don't know if I was going to color block one or not, but they had the same ones, and I was guessing that they were the same prints. I think they are. I'll have to find my Olga knit ones, or um, Olga Closet ones, but there's this animal print, and it has that thermal print um, or thermal knits with it and then this one and like I said if if there's not enough with the others to make a complete shirt I will go ahead and color block this but in my head I had it kind of I went it a certain way just like how I did with that green tie-dye and I thought you know it's only a few dollars a piece so I'll just go ahead and grab it so that was all the fabric and then okay so I know my punk broidery is they're not having any sales right now but they did have um, a few things that were on sale there were the flawed uh, vinyls which I've never seen any like flaws so they're very high quality with what they consider a flaw. Um, so this one is called Fairy Shimmer Cascade. And ooh, look how pretty. It's almost like a hollow kind of a color. So there's that. And then I got uh, the Precious Metals and this one's silver. I have a bag and I'll have to show it sometime and I had got it at a thrift store a long time ago and I love that bag and one day I will tear it apart and I will replace the vinyl and make it you know like remake it on my own but it'll need silver so there's that and this one is the precious metals alabaster so it's just it's white but it still has that sheen so I was interested on what color that would be and then this one is the precious metals rose gold 
and it's not really as rose gold as I thought. It's more of like a brownish, I guess. I mean, the color's showing up pretty true. So, but it's really pretty. So, and then I have got two of those. Okay, and then I got my first order from Bodio. And I, at first I was surprised how small the box was. A little clear picture, if you remember some of the vinyl I ordered on Amazon, came in boxes taller than my daughter. And I knew I ordered quite a bit from Bodio. And it came in this little box. And I was like, oh my gosh, did they forget my stuff? Did I not get all the things? Um, but it, it, it all came in. So they gave me this little slap band, which I thought was kind of cool. And I mean, I have to. Look, we've got a catnip mouse. Almost got the cat over here. <laughs> Alright, let me see if I can do this. I think I'm just going to have to hold it and show it. Okay, so I got this uh, purple. It's a grape. And I'm going to move closer. And it does look a little bit bluish purple, but it's still pretty. Then, roll that one back. And I do like the backing on them. They're, um, it's a woven backing, but it's not, like, fuzzy or anything, so I kind of like that. And then I got this black one. I think they called it coal or something. And then, oh, my favorite color again. This, um, I think it was alcove or something, but very pretty. I don't know if my camera is really showing how pretty these are. And then this one's a candy apple red. But it's got a nice shine to it. And then I got this turquoise -y, I guess. I think it's turquoise on this site. But it has a nice little shimmer to it. And that was it. Yeah, that's all of them. Okay, forgot where I put my box. So, that's all I have. <laughs> um, I will go ahead and let y'all go. Y'all have a very blessed day. And I will see you next time. Bye.